New tonight at 10 o'clock. Take a look at this. Caught on camera, thieves copping copper in one Phoenix neighborhood. Police say after a tough crackdown on catalytic converter thefts, criminals are resorting to old ways stealing copper items like pipes and wires. Thanks so much for joining us for 12 News at 10. I'm Rachel Cole. I'm Jonathan McCall. Team 12's Adriana Loya has the details tonight on the best things that you can do to protect yourself and your neighbors. At first glance, everything seems normal here. A man walks up to his car that's parked on the side of a road. It's one in the afternoon, sunny with a light breeze. But the man and this woman that then steps out of the passenger side of the same car are up to no good. It is an opportunity type of theft. The duel out stealing copper pipes. In less than three minutes, the pair pulls up to this condo complex near 10th Street and Camelback Road and costs thousands of dollars worth of damage. So it's about $1,700. The woman gets pliers, walks up to the pipes that are not seen on this security camera video and cuts a foot-long copper pipe. She later walks back to her car and the pair take off. Completely cut the pipe off here and cut off here. Actually, here, they had to replace this whole entire thing. Water was gushing up so high. Homeowner Mark Anthony Melonso surprised his community was hit. Wow, the people are very bold doing it in the daylight. Clearly the cameras didn't stop them. <laughs> no, not at all. They were very bold. 12 News reported criminals stealing thousands of dollars worth of copper wires from CenturyLink service boxes in the middle of the day. They're happening all the time. A similar crime shift. Phoenix Police Sergeant Brian Bauer says they've seen before. We ran into this same situation multiple years ago. Then it went to catalytic converters. And it seems like it's always a rotation. After a massive crackdown on catalytic converter thefts this year, authorities say criminals are shifting their focus to copper. Once they realize that they can't get money for catalytic converters, a lot of thieves will go to what's the next best opportunity, and that's going to be copper theft. Police say if you encounter someone doing this in your community, to never Never approach them. And the very first thing is contact 911. Document what they're doing with pictures or videos, which can help authorities identify and later prosecute them. Having those ring doorbells, having extra security, and having your neighbor be able to watch over your property is absolutely essential when it comes to prevention of this type of theft. Covering up exposed pipes, adding lights or cameras can help too. Adriana Loya, 12 News.